Hey gang, welcome back. It is Cam Cowboy here with another video. Um, I was doing a, I was taking a look at another person's account, doing an account review for them. Um, they opted for an account review over their ten dollar gift card that they won in the giveaway. So I was giving them an account review, and I realized, hey, this person has amazing guards. They're not a high spender, pretty low spender. And I'm looking into I'm looking into the deals that are being given away, and I'm realizing the cost to go for, to five stars is absolutely insane. How cheap it is now, not on these guards, but on the older premium guards, and the benefits that you're going to be getting out of it is just absolutely phenomenal. Um. So once we go ahead and find these <laughs> deals, we can go ahead and talk about them. But basically, if you're going to be buying the guards, it's going to be a lot cheaper. So I was looking into it, and you could get all three of the <coughs> the Durangatang, the Kitty, and Blanchet for $250 each. Five stars. Now, I believe that's if you already have four stars. But we can confirm that here in a second. So stay tuned, but basically, you are getting a lot more um, than you normally would. And that what well, we have been. You know, it used to cost about sixty-four hundred dollars to go from one to five stars, but now it only costs um, two hundred fifty dollars. So it's gotten a lot cheaper, and it's absolutely something that you really want to take a look at because not only are we going to be getting this fifty percent distance attack out of five stars for Durangatang. And yes, I know that's not Durangatan. But you're also going to be getting all these... Uh, I don't know why that's not showing up on my screen. You're also going to be getting all the Dashing Duelist stats. So, minus 20% distance damage received. Not a great stat. Not something I really care about. But you're also getting 25% cavalry damage. You're getting troop attack plus 20%. You're getting march capacity plus 25,000. You're getting infantry damage received minus 25%. So you're getting some really good stats in addition to this. And you're also going to be getting, let's take a look at Kitty. Kitty's going to be 50% distance attack. That's an awesome stat as well. Um, plus, you know, you're going to be getting this. And for $250, that, that's just phenomenal. I can't imagine, you know, how much money I would spend for a 50% upgrade in the past. Um, it, it's just nowhere close to what we're getting now with our value. Now the problem with Kitty that I have is that the third star is absolutely useless. The fourth star is absolutely useless. So my Kitty is only, well, two stars. But to go to three stars, to go to four stars, and go to five stars, you know, it's probably worth it. Because it's so much cheaper now. And it's the same thing with Blanchett. But Blanchett, you're getting all these stats being great stats to have. And troop defense plus 30%, that's phenomenal. So, I would highly recommend, you know, you go up to 5 stars and blanch it. Now, I'm not recommending that you go for the new guards that just came out. The new guards are not worth it. Like, Benoit, even older, you're getting even more fragments for your money. Go up to another 50% distance attack. And you're also going to be getting 50% cavalry defense and 50% distance defense. I would only get it for the cavalry defense. I don't care about the distance defense. But this is just phenomenal. And, you know, it's such low quantities of money, relatively speaking, to what it used to be. Now, it's still a lot of money. It's something that you're going to want to work towards. But I think it's really well worth it. I, I, I truly do. And Captain Trevor, he's equally as good. And you're getting another 30% troop health as that fifth star. You know, it, it's worth it. It's worth it in my opinion. So I think that that's something everyone wants to take a look at. Um, you know, I personally haven't spent my money on my guards yet. I still have a four-star Durangatan. Um, getting a fifth star, you know, I need 320 fragments. Now, that's only 300 for me. Now, if it's 10 fragments per $10... It's going to cost me three hundred dollars. 
it's pretty simple math. I mean, it's three hundred dollars to get an extra fifty percent distance attack. So when you break it down, it's about a dollar and fifty cents per percent. That's better than the, like the little banners that you buy for like the special like Valentine's Day bun banner that gives you two percent. Like it's a better bang for your buck. Like it's 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 pretty solid deal right now. Not gonna lie. Um, and it goes the same with all the rest of the people. But like to me, it doesn't make sense to go and buy the new guards. Like, um, let's go have, go ahead and pull up the new guards. So, Madame Mose or however you pronounce her name, great stats, phenomenal. But the amount that you're going to be spending compared to Duke of Buckingham, that's free. It's not worth it. Simply, is not worth it. And it's the same with everyone else. It ju it just doesn't make sense to make the transition to Oliver Cromwell doesn't make sense I mean if you're gonna spend the money go spend the money but I I personally would wait until it goes cheaper like all the rest of our guards have because it will happen eventually so if you take your time with it keep using your guards that you have now in those positions and then once these high percentages are worth it you know you can make the switch later on but that's everything I have. This is the new meta. <laughs> There's a couple different metas that I've got to show you all tonight. So stay tuned.